it's bunnies welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are having an amazing day today was interesting to say the least so today we are going to be trying some mcdonald's food and i'm excited but i'm a little bit disappointed so i went to burger king originally and i was going to try the monster burger from burger king monster burger nightmare nightmare what is it nightmare king nightmare royal i think from burger king and i was super stoked to try it because like my viewers told me about it for my stream and it's not out until next week it was so sad so i went over to mcdonald's and i got their spicy new glazed chicken tenders so sweet and spicy honey barbecue chicken tenders so we're gonna be eating that and trying it today and then also another one of my viewers you know who you are told me to try a mcflurry and cookies and make like a homemade ice cream sandwich with it which sounded really bomb so we're gonna be eating that today and yeah it's nighttime also it's 7 30 and i just got in streaming i haven't eaten yet today well i had an egg sandwich this morning so i haven't eaten yet today so i'm so freaking hungry <laughs> and i'm really excited to eat i really wanted a burger though so i'm kind of sad <laughs> you guys are eating what are you eating with me these look i've never had mcdonald's chicken tenders this is what they look like It's kind of strange because they didn't ask me if I wanted any ranch. I just realized that. I was like, where's the ranch at? <laughs> um. They're not bad. If anyone's ever tried the Tyson's barbecue chicken tenders that you can like warm up yourself. That's exactly what this tastes like. McDonald's, hey, real talk. If anyone works at McDonald's or, yeah, if anyone works at McDonald's, are these Tyson's, like, honey barbecue chicken tenders from Walmart? Because I'm telling you, this is exactly what they taste like. Like, to a T. They're really good, but... I wouldn't say they're spicy. Hmm. So. Yeah. They're not spicy. <laughs> I mean, like, maybe. Wait. Wait a minute. Is this considered a. <laughs> Time out. Is this considered a chicken tender comparison to this? One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> this is considered a chicken tender. Know that you might get, um, the sizes might be different. I'm assuming they do it by weight. But, I ordered a six piece tender. <laughs> it's very interesting. Oh. That one's really barbecuey. <laughs> like, not spicy, but like really hickory barbecue kind of like taste. But, mm, I had really high hopes for this, you guys. <laughs> I think, you know what I need to start doing? Is like super lowering my standards. I try to. I try to usually set my standards pretty low for like fast food. No shots or anything like that, but I feel like when I set my standards low for stuff, by the way, if you guys hear my heater going, I'm so sorry. It's cold outside. It's like the first couple days of it actually turning into being really chilly out. But anyways, um, I try to lower my standards for fast food and certain things because like, I feel like when you lower your standards and then it's, if it's good, it's like, oh my God, you're like super happy and like surprised versus if you're like, mm, it's going to be bomb and then you have it and you're like, eh. Can I taste like Tyson's? I literally cannot get over how much it tastes like Tyson's. <laughs> you guys! If anyone's ever had Tyson's chicken tenders 
a McDonald's new spicy barbecue honey barbecue chicken tenders. Let me know if I'm crazy, right? I'm not crazy. This is like the same thing. This also is a little bit more barbecue on this one. But like, other than that, they taste like exactly the same. All right, so, mm. I'm gonna, I'm squatting by the way. <laughs> I don't know why I'm squatting. I was sitting on the floor because I wanted to eat, but now I'm kind of like over sitting on the floor. And I could go to my table, but I don't want to. <gasps> oh no! I asked for two fresh cookies because I didn't know you could do that, and this is how they came. <laughs> That's not gonna go great for a cookie sandwich. McDonald's! Oh, that's so sad. Well, we're still gonna attempt to make flurry cookie sandwich. So these are actually still like super warm. And, mm. okay, I'm gonna sit back down. Those are still super warm. So my McFlurry is a bit on the melted side. Wow. <laughs> um, so we're gonna take some McFlurry. I actually got some hot fudge in my McFlurry today. I got an Oreo McFlurry with some hot fudge in it because I felt like it would be good because I love hot fudge. I, I actually like really love McDonald's sundaes. It's like one of my favorite things at McDonald's. I love McDonald's hot fudge. Anyways, let's put the cookie kind of like just on it and see what happens. <sighs> I'm gonna eat it like this, you guys. Oh, okay. It's a bit melted. Oh my God. <sighs> you guys. It's not, I think all the ice cream like fell off. It's like all down there. I don't even care. Oh my God, you guys. Oh my God. Mm. You know what? This. <laughs> was worth it. The lack of like <laughs> excitement for the tenders were made up 100% by this cookie and McFlurry combo. I've never had this before in my life. Does it on my face? Oh my god. <laughs> you guys, I actually thought that was like a dot on my camera. And I was like, stupid dot. No, it's just my breakout. <laughs> no big deal. So anyways, even eating like this, you guys, it's so good. Mmm. Okay. One thing we know is this is going to be very bad for my lactose intolerancy. But it's totally worth it. Oh my gosh, you guys, you have to try this. Like, real talk, if you do this, eat it, like, right then and there. Because my McFlurry kind of melted. Mm. But it's still, like, 10 out of 10, you know? Mmm. Mmm. Oh, my God, you guys. So, now you guys have it. You can get... Mmm. My bad. So now you guys have it. You can get a ice cream sandwich at McDonald's. You just have to make it yourself. But 10 out of 10, I would recommend it. I think I have stuff all over my face. <laughs> I'm so sorry. And I just completely like scarfed that down. My fault. But you can get the um, Oreo McFlurry. I added hot fudge. It's really good with hot fudge if you've never tried it. 10 out of 10 would recommend it. But hot, um, McFlurry with two fresh, just ask him for fresh cookies. I remember I asked Lenny. Lenny's actually the one who told me to do the cookie thing and or the ice cream sandwich thing. And I was like, you can order fresh cookies because I had no idea. And he's like, yeah, he's like, it only takes him like two minutes to make. So you can order fresh cookies, by the way, if you didn't know. And they're really good. Like really good. Like they just taste like regular homemade chocolate chip cookies. Like not like from scratch, but like, I don't know, like 
Nestle or Toll House, like those kind of cookies, but they're really good. Plus with the McFlurry, ah, oh my God. I actually think that's like better than, I would say that that, that ice cream sandwich, I'm speechless. I'd say that ice cream sandwich is like, maybe better than like the Toll House ice cream cookie sandwiches. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm, ta you know what I'm talking about? It's like, oh, maybe a little bit better level than that. Like it's really good. To me, those that's my favorite ice cream are like the Toll House cookie sandwiches. I love them. So that's like better than that because it's like fresh. So anyways, I'm gonna head out now. If you can't tell, I really enjoyed the dessert. The chicken was kind of meh, so. I wouldn't really recommend the chicken. They just taste kind of meh. Like they're okay, but I recommend like a four piece if you're gonna try them. So thank you guys so much for watching and hanging out with me today. If there's something you wanna see me eat um, or try in the next video, comment it down below. I'll be trying Burger King's Nightmare Burger when it comes out, I think. So I'll see you guys in the next video. I love you guys so much. Bye guys. Mwah.